Many people have heard of the old saying that states that the oldest children in a family are usually extremely responsible. Children that are only children are more likely to be self-centered and demanding. That's an interesting question. What do you think? Today, we're going to answer this interesting question. Studies have shown that birth order may have an impact on personality. The birth order theory began in the 1920s with Alfred Adler, Sigmund Freud's friend and colleague. Adler believed that the order in which we were born into a family inherently effectual personality. Here is the theory. The firstborn child, according to Adler, the oldest child tends to be conservative, power oriented and predisposed towards leadership. They often take responsibility for the younger siblings. That's why firstborns grow up to be more caring, more willing to become parents, more likely to take initiative. The middle child, the older brother or sister is a pace setter for the second child. That's why they often struggle to surpass their older sibling. The pace of development is higher. The middle kids in a family often tend to be ambitious, but they're rarely selfish. They're also more likely to set unreasonably high goals for themselves. This increases the number of failures. However, knowing how to cope with difficulties in life is what makes them stronger. The youngest child, as a rule, the youngest child gets a lot of care and attention from parents and even older siblings. That's why they may feel less experienced and independent. However, lastborns are usually highly motivated to surpass their older sisters and brothers. They achieve big success and a recognition in their chosen field very often. They become the fastest athletes, the best musicians, and most talented artists. The youngest children and family tend to be very sociable though. They're usually more irresponsible and frivolous than the older children. The only child, without any siblings to compete with the only child, often competes with his or her father, being overly pampered by their parents. The single child expects pampering and protection from everyone around to dependency and self-centeredness are the leading qualities of our lives. The only child often has difficulty interacting with peers. Many children who have no siblings become perfectionists, and they usually achieve their goals no matter what. Now all of these lead to three important questions. Question 1. How does birth order affect IQ scores? There is a theory saying that the order in which you are born has an impact on your personality and IQ level. This idea has become very popular recently, however. It has also created quite a divide amongst researchers. Some dismiss the theory entirely and others are convinced it plays a crucial role. Researchers from the University of Leipzig, Gangaya Guttenberg University of Maine studied more than 20,000 adults for United States, United Kingdom, and Germany. In the study, they compared siblings within families and the orders of their birth. They found the older children generally show higher performance and intelligence tests. However, the scientists found no birth order effects on emotional stability and imagination. Question number two. How does birth order affect your personality? Another study provided more evidence that birth order affects your personality. The researchers analyzed personality traits of 377,000 high school students in the USA. They found the firstborns tend to be more honest and dominant. However, they're also less social and less resistant to stress. Middle children tend to be more conscientious and diligent. The youngest child in a family is more likely to be open and sociable kids who have no siblings are often nervous, but they also quite outgoing as social. And finally, question number three, is birth order really that important? You have to admit the results of these studies have a number of inaccuracies. The research doesn't take into account important social factors, such as ethnicity, education, parents' welfare and relationships within a family. Birth order may have a certain impact on your personality or intelligence. However, don't forget the parent-child relationships and the upbringing that children receive in their homes are much more important factors in shaping their lives as individuals. Do you agree with all of this? Feel free to share your thoughts and the comments down below and hit the thumbs up button if you've enjoyed this video. If you are visiting our channel for the first time, click subscribe to stay on the deep side of life.